Hey guys, how's it going and welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Now today we are reacting to Barack Obama versus Mitt Romney. Epic rap battles of history. Now. I am looking forward to this one. This is one that I have watched before, but the election was years ago. So yeah, this is going to be a blast from the past. And yeah, I'm looking forward to getting into it. Hopefully there are some good bars. We reacted to the Trump versus Clinton one. So I thought it would only be fair if we reacted to the Obama versus Romney one. And yeah, if you guys are new around here, make sure to like, subscribe, and let's get into the video. Here we go, guys. Obama versus Mitt Romney. <laughs> Here he is. Wow, that is good. I'm not gonna let this battle be dictated by facts. I'm rich. I got fat stacks and super. All right. We all know what went down in that 2008 election. You're a decent politician with a winning complexion. You're all uh, not sure about that. No change. We're all still hoping that you'll shut your mouth. Like when Tatamo Bay the both open You're from the windy Trey. city where you're looking pretty with your blowhards, but come January you'll be left evicted and with no job. Ooh. I'm stronger than my jawline when I spit a phrase, knocking you harder than front doors in my own mission day. Yeah. You see the silver spoon, this the mass out of debt. Took you four years to drop unemployment down below eight percent. You feel <laughs> you're all dudes. Everyone's having doubts. Everyone's having you're doubts. Weak is this economy that you've done nothing about. Call me a vicious business. Okay. Stop me stealing this race. I'll go bank capital on your donkey ass. We structured your face. Oh. Your and we'll pause it there, guys. Wow. So he's he's going off a little bit. Um, try to think. We started. He said, "We all know went went down in that 2008 election. You're a decent politician with a winning complexion." I I I don't. I'm not too sure about that one. I'd say it's more of the opposite, to be honest. Um, yeah, he's he's going off like he took you eight years to drop unemployment down below eight percent. He's he's going hard. He's saying that things are looking a bit uncertain for you, so you're gonna really need to. Yeah, he's he's putting a lot of uncertainty on this, so I'm hoping that Obama can fire back with some fire. All right, let's keep it going. I was a great man. You must be what's left. Need to stop <laughs> hating on gays. Let them teach you how to dress. You got the <laughs> and a Mr. Fantastic face. So rich and white, it's like I'm running against a cheesecake. Republicans <laughs> need a puppet, and you fed. Got their hands so far up your rear, call you mate. I'm the head of state. <laughs> You're like a head of cabbage, about to get smacked by my stimulus package. You're a <laughs> bad right. no chance. You can't even touch me. I got four more years. Two turns. And a White House. Just <laughs> Two me. turns. I hope you saved your best rhymes for the second half. Because right now, I'm 47% for kicking your ass. Whatever. That right, and that was his first. Yeah, this was really good. Like, they, they, he has a lot more punchlines. Like, uh, Romney was going off, like, <clears throat> he was going a lot more harder, saying, like, talking about the politics, making everything seem a bit serious. And he's coming in being, like, so rich and white. He's like, running gets a cheesecake. Really got the hand so far, if you really call you mitt. That was really good. And then I'm trying to work out. He said, yeah, and I'm 47% through. Kicking your ass, and I'm trying to think um, what this 47% thing's all about because it rings a bell. It's just I can't remember it exactly, but you know, it's good so far. Obama's come with some good punchlines. Let's keep it going. 40% thing got you real mad. Wouldn't it remind you how many decent parents you had? Uh, look, I respect our religions, uh, but it might get crazy if the White House is a first, second, and a third lady. <laughs> Don't bring up wives, man. What are you doing? You got hitched to the female version of Patrick Ewing. Uh, let me be clear. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> if you guys don't know who Patrick Ewing is, I'll put a picture up on the screen right here. <laughs> uh, 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 I mean, uh, <laughs> I mean, that's probably the best diss so far in this song. Oh my God. Right, let's keep it going. Don't get it twisted. We'll see how pretty your face is after my face is kissed. Uh, uh, All right. Are uh, you a stuttering communist? Oh yeah, well you're, Not stu really. you're stupid. No, uh. uh, uh the power <laughs> Come on, here we go. The president shall not be the shiniest of two turns. Do I want to like you? Don't talk about change to do it. I thought what was on my brain, I tell I put it with. He did. He did. All right. Oh, 
And there we go. <laughs> See, the main difference in the ending between Trump and Clinton is he actually slapped both of them equally. And they, these were little ones. When he was doing it with Trump and Clinton, he was proper whacking him across the face and he did it twice to Trump. So <clears throat> at least he's being more fair this time. But yeah, this was really good. I think, like I said, Romney had the best insult with um, Patrick Ewing. I'll put the picture back up here. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, and then Obama was coming nice with the punchlines, like the cheesecake, uh, the first, second and a third lady, yeah, that was really good. Um, I've got to say, this one is the most entertaining, I really enjoyed this one, and yeah, if there's any other ones you want me to react to, whack it in the comment section, and yeah, if you guys enjoyed, please like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later for another episode of the Ricky Gervais Show. Peace.